Okay, in my bedroom, I installed some faux stained glass films on the windows, and uh, I've had them on there for a while now, but I need to remove them because when I, when I measured the windows, I miscalculated, so when I got these films in the mail, uh, they just didn't turn out well because the measurements were off. And putting them on was a, was a hassle, but I have heard and I have seen that removing them is even more of a hassle. It's a pain in the butt. And uh, so I've been praying this moment, but I finally did it. And this is what I'm going to share with you guys. These are my bedroom windows and these are the faux stained glass window films. And as you can see, they look ugly due to the miscalculation in the measurement and look at that gap there. So I've seen people remove these window films with uh, uh, hair blow dryers and they heat up the windows. But I just thought to myself, if that works, then I'll just wait for the sun to heat the, the windows up naturally. And that's what I've done. So um, at this angle, the sun is really hitting the windows uh, directly and the windows are quite warm and, and, and hot. Look how easily I was able to peel this film off, it, like nothing, it was just really easy. And it actually, this method actually worked. Okay, that's one down, two to go. This was a piece of cake, it felt really good just peeling it off. It didn't, I didn't uh, struggle at all. And look, it looks... Uh, it looks quite good, I think. And uh, now, now on to the last two. Once the window films were off, they did leave some residue. So I started off with scraping it. And I used this one here, uh, this one. I tried the big one that didn't work. The middle, the little one seemed to work better. And it was just really easy. You just scrape it off and it came off like nothing. So once I finished scraping the residue off, they did leave some smudges. So once I I was done scraping off the the hard stuff to remove, then I used this go Gooby Gone to clean the smudges, and they came off easily with this. And then I just wiped it with the regular paper towel. And once I was done wiping it off with these uh, with this gooby gone then to wipe the whole window off I rubbed uh, I wiped it off, uh, off with 70% uh, rubbing alcohol and that left my windows super clean and now that I know how to remove window films and how to put them on there I'm definitely going I can't wait to put the new ones on and that'll be really nice what I forgot to mention is that when you're actually pulling the window film off of the uh, actual window, wear some gloves because initially I didn't wear any gloves. So the first one that I removed, it left my fingertips really sore, really shaved. So then the next day, which was when I removed the rest of the films, I used a, a uh, I used some gloves and that helped me a lot and, and my fingers were okay. Uh, no more, no more aches and, and hurting.